welcome back to my channel. I wanted to do a quick like life update um, video, like what's going on with me. I am almost feeling 100%. I am almost back to normal, <laughs> which is a really good sign. Um, I have been poorly. I had a viral for six weeks and I just couldn't shift it. Now I don't know if that's because I was working nights and I wasn't able to sleep properly and rest and get rid of it and all that sort of stuff. Um, but yes, so I've had blood tests um, and they test me for all sorts of things which I'm not sure. I'll let you know when I get the results back so fingers crossed everything is fine. Um, also, Reggie's playing with his bone right here. So, I have also got carpal tunnel in my left hand and wrist. And carpal tunnel is basically um, something to do with like the nerve endings. And I get really bad like pins and needles in my wrist. And then it goes into like my fingertips. I've taken on my wedding ring and my engagement ring because I thought it might be that. But it doesn't seem to be that that's causing the problem. So I've been sent for yet more bloods for something else. So basically they check for arthritis, diabetes, and underactive thyroid. Now I would love them to come back and say, yes, Jade, you have underactive thyroid. <laughs> because that means I'll be able to lose weight with the right medicine. <laughs> but I don't think that's gonna happen because I've been tested for it before and it's always come back that I'm fully functioning, so. That is an update. Another update is the big life decision or change that we have sort of made. Ruben's here, as you can see his arm. Um, no, I'm just stretching. The, um, we are going to try for a baby after Christmas. Um, I'm not sure Ruben's really excited because he really desperately wants a sibling. Um, Brother. He wants a brother, but we can't determine if it's going to be a boy or girl. So it's just oh, potluck, I, isn't I, it? I want it to be a, a boy. You want it to be a boy? Yeah. <laughs> but you're going to have to make up for me. I would love to have a girl. Um, Obviously, so I've got a boy and a girl. And because I'm sort of like so girly, I'm really like pink and glittery and well, laced. I have and... a lot of friends. That's probably why, because I just want a boy. Right. But if friends. God plans for me or us to have two boys then I'm all for it so that is another thing that we have sort of like spoke about and decided on um I have PCOS I'm not sure if I've mentioned it in a <coughs> vlog before or a video before so I am currently um I've had one lot of bloods and then I've got to go for another lot and basically they tested for the is it the pedestrian pedestrian in um my system a week before um I'm due on my period and my last blood test come back and the count was five so I think that's like the levels that they determine and the doctor basically said it was highly unlikely that I had ovulated last month which is fine it's not like a big deal because you know I'm not we're not trying we're not having treatment yet or anything like that it was just sort of to gauge where we're at um if it comes back on the next blood test that I've got to go for in two weeks time that it comes back that the level is low um, the doctor will subscribe me Clomid which will help me will make my body ovulate basically um, so that's all exciting also we have three months a day or 12 weeks however you want to look at it until Hayley's birthday getaway I am so excited are you picking your nose on camera? no I think he was, but yeah. I wasn't really looking. Yeah. <laughs> um, we are really, really, well, me and Ruben are like ecstatic. We can't wait, because Ruben knows where we're going. He's doing so well in keeping it quiet. And he's so excited. Um, I'm not gonna tell you still, I'm gonna wait until I actually reveal it to Hayley, and then I'm gonna upload it um, before we go. Ruben knows where we're going. I did yeah. say that before, didn't I? Yeah, I wanted to say that. <laughs> Also, I have quit my night shift work. It wasn't for me. There's various reasons why um, I basically am not going back. Um, on Monday night, I was driving to work and my um, car coolant light came on and then it went from like 90 degrees on the dial to where it always sits when I'm driving all the way around to 113 in the red zone. So, that was not great. So I turned round, went to one petrol garage and they didn't have the coolant I needed. Then I went to another one and they still didn't have the one that I needed because I've been scaremongered when going to the shop because we've got a Volkswagen to only use one type of coolant. But I don't know, I'm not a mechanic, I haven't got a clue. So 
we've got a leak in the coolant it's leaking on the undercover um so in a way that is a plus because then it's not going into the engine so it's not the head gasket or something oh i don't know so that is what's been going on um i am going to be back filming monday a wednesday a friday and then either a saturday or sunday we're doing a clean with me but i'm going to split it into two i'm going to do my downstairs deep clean and then my upstairs deep clean because if you could see my upstairs you would be like oh my god i need to unfollow her because she is such a tramp <laughs> that's what i feel like um so i am just really excited just to be back and again i just want to thank you all so much for sticking around i know i haven't been the best um, just being poorly and now without a car I can't even go to Poundland because Poundland's like 10 miles away I suppose I could get a bus but I'm not sure if I want to bus it to be honest so I'm not sure you're doomed. <laughs> I'm doomed uh, I'm just doing a lot more walking the oh the other thing I managed to get a job on camp back in well not back in but I'm over at another bar which I'm really excited about I start tomorrow it's only 16 hour week uh, 16 hours a week to start with but I'm just super like, thrilled like, like that's just what I wanted to do like I wanted to be back on camp working the mum at work now. yeah so basically there's different bars different ranks and the bar that I will be working in around the corner or wherever it is is basically a section for Haley's rank um and then the, the the other bit i'll be working in is for ranks below her which i'm just really really excited i love bar work i'm really sociable and i just really enjoy it and i think it's just something that i feel comfortable doing because i can pour a mean pint <laughs> so yes again i just want to say thank you so much for sticking around i really appreciate you all and i will see you friday it just depends on um how things run because i have to take ruben to school come back to the dog out and it's just a bit mad at the moment so i'm which just really excited and it's christmas in like what four um, weeks and five days or something which is really exciting also if you would let me know down in the comments what sort of videos you want to see just so i can start planning a bit more so i know what i'm doing and i just want to be able to put footage out is it footage content i just want to be able to put content out that you're going to enjoy and, and watch basically so i will see you next time and thank you again see you later bye <laughs>